Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm building a copy of the known Soul Train. Well, I'm not sure if everyone knows it, but if you ever heard of it, you might know that it's a scary, scary train. For you that doesn't know it, I can at least tell you something about it. They say that the Lord of the Underworld, also uh, called the Master, that's his favorite, had this train to travel from realm to realm and collect all the souls he meant had sinned to him. Because if you were someone that can uh, find out how to live forever, or even plead to the Grim Reaper, and the Grim Reaper would say, "All right, I'll leave. It. I'll let you live for a little bit longer." That was a sin for him. So, the train's job and the crews on it are to travel and go and find all the souls that tried to hide from him, or at least cheat death, so they can collect them and bring them back down to the master. Like every train, this train also has a conductor. His name is Nicholas Orpheus. He was once, in his lifetime, the most evil sim there was. It's been told that because of him, the vamp vampires knows how to use the plasma from other sims to live longer. Or even cheat death, because they are dead after all. The Dark Lord decided that, fine, I'll let the vampires do their bidding, at least for their sake. They get actually kind of more souls if the vampires kill them. But one day, Mr. Nicholas got hit by lightning pretty hard. So hard, in fact, that he died. And as the Grim Reaper do, he showed up and brought him back down to the master. The master looked at Nicholas and said that he could use someone with his skills, because Nicholas wasn't a very nice man, he was pretty mean. And he wanted him to be the conductor of his train. If not, he had to stay down in his realm, where he can never leave, and he has no power at all. Nicholas saw this as a really good offer, because he didn't mind picking up others, kicking and screaming. He found great joy in it, actually. So he said yes. And from there on, Nicholas became the conductor on the Soul Train. The crew of the Soul Train isn't like any other crew. They are spiders and bats. Small spiders, big spiders. They say that if someone tries to run from the train, the spiders will jump off the train and chase them. Even the bats that flies around it will swoop down and pick you up. If you ever see the train, do not go near it. Because they said that sometimes the bats and the spiders can't really tell the difference from a soul they are meant to collect and a soul that is just looking at the train. They are even been told that sometimes they even pick up people that weren't meant to die yet. But the thing is, they don't ever see them again. What do the Dark Lord do with them? Many have asked. They say that the Dark Lord doesn't like being wrong. And see it maybe as their own fault for getting caught by being too curious. Anyway, it's hard to tell what the Dark Lord actually think. At least we know that they never return. Of all the different realms you can find in the Sims world, there is at least one realm the Soul Train can't get to. And that is the Magic Realm. You see, the train relies on the ground to place down the tracks it runs on. But in the Magic Realm, there is no grounded, really. It floats. So, 
If you ever know that the train is looking for you, get your ass to Glimmerbrook. Jump to the portal. It's your only way out. And if you're someone who thinks you should live forever, I'm sorry, you also will be collected. They say that even the people that, are that knows how to live forever are collected and then live forever down in the underworld, since you can't really die, no can ya? Imagine how that must be like, not just being dead and having a soul sent down, but being alive and still have to go down. So therefore, I decided it's time to build the soul train, so you all will recognize it if you ever see it. You see, once I was one of the souls that he felt like collecting, and I was so lucky, I got my ass right into that portal. And I'm living now happily in the magic realm. Hmm. But I don't know. Maybe one day I'll leave. Let's hope that the spiders aren't there waiting for me. Or maybe I can make a deal and be the new conductor. Hmm. Who knows? Anyway, I hope you have fun. Bye bye.